Baby Battle, where we take a look at the challenges of parenthood, and this morning we're going to focus on temper tantrums. We're going to talk to celebrity nanny Constance Simpson after Diane Macedo shows us how she helped one family dealing with meltdowns. Here you go, buddy. Audra Brandsgrove loves spending time with her son, William. Car is that? Ferrari. But over the summer, Audra says she noticed a change, and her generally well-behaved three-year-old suddenly turned into a three-nager. He just started like tantrums all the time. There would be nights that he would be in his room and he would just be screaming. <laughs> Temperament wise, it was just like, oh my gosh, I do not know what has happened to my child. Now with a new baby on the way, the 32 year old mom is searching for solutions to tame the tantrums. Every once in a while I talk to him as if he is an adult. And I'm like, William, why does everything have to be a battle? Hi! So we How called in you? Nanny Connie, the baby whisperer that A-listers like Jessica Beale, Justin Timberlake, and Jessica Alba swear by. Oh man, it's a fun age, but yes. it has definitely been harder. Yes. Harder than two was. Yes, because they are even smarter. And temper tantrums are just them trying to be vocal and they can't be vocal. Right. Or trying to get your attention right. and they can't get your attention. Yeah and they feel like if I act out, you'll come to my rescue even faster. Nanny Connie's baby battle game plan? Use a star chart to reward positive behavior with stickers. They work so well with visuals. Yeah. And let him see, today you did it all the way through. And then when he gets it all the way through, well, mom, I, I achieved it this week. Next, set a timer to create a routine and parameters around playtime. He wants to play with his trucks. Okay, fine. You get 15 more minutes or you get five more minutes. Sit the timer with me. But if that timer leads to a tantrum, hit the snooze button. First ring being, so now he knows that I'm close to the end so that we just don't cut him off cold turkey. Armed with Nanny Connie's advice, the Brands Groves put it to the test. Have you been doing so good with all of your stickers? Uh -huh. Are we so proud? Yeah. For Good Morning America, Diane Macedo, ABC News, New York. Thanks, Diane. We're joined now by Constance Simpson, author of The Nanny Connie Way. Thanks for coming in. Thank you. Uh, good morning. Right <laughs> yeah, give me a good hand right there. So, so this is all about stopping tantrums before they start. Yes, it is. Um, I try to always enable my parents with the skills that they need because they are always looked at and I try to do it with uh, Jess and Justin. For an example, with having Silas come along and being a little boy, they're going to act out, you know, and so you want to be, have, be prepared as opposed to be in the situation and not be prepared. And I can't tell you the number of times she said, Thanks, Nanny. That really worked because I cut it off at the pass. That's good news yes. right there. And Audra <laughs> yes. and William, we just saw them in the piece there here in the front row. Hey, William, how's it going? Hey, hi. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us how it worked for you. It's been going really well. It's definitely been a process of trial and error <laughs> and uh, figuring out what works for him. But the star chart at bedtime has revolutionized our bedtime routine. He's so happy to put the stickers on. That's reward enough for him. So it's been really great. That's great. And, and you actually have something to add to the star chart. Yes. Um, I think putting the toys in timeout as, the, as opposed to putting your kids in timeout because parents are so overwhelmed, they, don't, they forget about kids in timeout. Mm -hmm. So if you put your kids in timeout, which we have over our timeout box, mm -hmm. then you feel like, okay, the child can earn it back. So you put the, the, ki the toys in timeout in the timeout box like that. And then... Then they earn it back. They earn it back, okay. You know, so now they're learning, to, like, for every action, there's a reaction. Now, even the best laid plans don't always work. They don't. So you're out in public. Amen. There's a meltdown. <laughs> what do you do? Well, if it's a short run, you take them to the car, somewhere where you can have your, I would say, your come to Jesus. And if that doesn't work in the car, then you shut it down and you head home and you start all over. And that's the part of being a parent. You can't always go out and do everything you want to do. So you have to take the good with the bad. Okay. Great yeah. advice. Thanks yeah. for coming in today, Nanny. Thanks to <laughs> you all as well. Thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.